Before we get into the video, I need you guys to do me a favour. Number 1. Get this video to at least 200 likes. Also comment. Let me know your thoughts on the case. If you're a music fan, especially hip-hop or rap, then you are not under any influence or illusion that some music beef is so entrenched into a person's DNA that they will go for extreme lengths to score points, even committing them, even if it meant a crowd full of people. It's like certain caliber or breed of rappers are programmed to erase all competition over silly and trivial grievances that could be avoided, but hip-hop and rap is treacherous. Case in point, the 19-year-old rapper who acquired himself a rocket launcher, Missile, in order to decimate, eradicate, slaughter a rival in 2019. And the silly thing about it was, he didn't care who he was going to get. 19-year-old Little Dell, whose real name is Cordelius Dias, was part of a gang of overzealous teenagers who were unorganised and wild, who let off more than 40 rounds into a large crowd near the Platinum nightclub in Florida. Now common sense would say acquiring a pistol or something larger and pressing that trigger when aiming at a crowd is a silly thing to do. It's asinine. But being born and raised in Pensacola, Florida, often described as the toughest and poorest area in the Western world where 27% of young people struggle to eat 3 square meals a day, you know that Little Dell was not engaged in his brain. Now Little Dell represented the bro gang and their known nemesis was the cash gang. The beginning of the calamity and shattered lives started way back in 2017 over an incident in the Pensacola Interstate Fair where a brawl sparked a shooting. Now ever since then, Florida police say that the results of the warfare between the two gangs resulted in at least 22 M's. Now subsequently, in May 2019, the bro gang and Little Dell made national headlines. Little Dell and the bro gang heard that members of the cash gang would be at the Platinum nightclub. Arriving with at least a dozen people at 2am, Little Dell spotted someone in the crowd. That could be from cash gang. Now Little Dell signalled. Him and his pals pulled out their pistols, took aim and then fired more than 40 times, fatally striking an innocent woman, 20 year old Elizabeth Harris. Now as quickly as Little Dell and the bro gang arrived was as quick as they disappeared into the night. Police found 44 casings at the crime scene. Now police quickly looked through CCTV and found that criminals behind Elizabeth Harris M was due to the issues between the bro gang and the cash gang. So of course people rounded up. Three main people from the bro gang was quickly arrested. Dante Walker, Tequan Warren and Marquisa James. All three teenagers were facing either an M or accessory. So of course after eating a Big Mac and Coke and talking to the police officers, someone decided to tell. And they told on Little Dell and explained how Little Dell had actually brought a rocket launcher to the Platinum nightclub and was intent on using it. He fired the rocket launcher but it misfired and the missile hit a car instead. Now police quickly turned their attention to Little Dell who had already left Florida and was on the run so he was a wanted man. Police eventually found Little Dell in Georgia in a small town and of course he was arrested and charged with an M also. Now the question on everybody's minds is was it all worth it? Stay safe. Safe.